guys, it is Blue Girl here, and today we are playing Get to the Top. So let's just get straight to it. So in this game, basically, well, you can kind of see me demonstrating it here. You basically have to well get to the top of the tower. I only just joined, so we only have three minutes. Originally, you usually have five minutes. So as you can see, I am a professional at this game. Totally, yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, um, I'm not extremely good at this game. I mean, nobody's perfect, but I especially suck. Uh, why is there a random chicken here? Apparently. <laughs> okay. So, I apparently tried to jump through a block. And for the period of time, I completely forgot that there's four items at the side that you can easily use. Rip. Anyways, so... Basically, as I said, the aim of the game is to well get to the top of the tower, and that's exactly what I'm trying to do. And Ryan J Moss is the winner. Penguin. I got 113 studs high. Wonderful. Okay. Oh yeah. By the way, in the top left, there are um your points. So that's how many points I now have. So yeah, generation tower. <laughs> We have done that, and yeah, tower is done. Uh, you can also get near the tower while it's loading, so you kind of have a head start. That's a little cheat in the game. You just got to remember that it's kind of unfair on the other players. So I just dropped a mine somewhere, I think. That's how it was from last round, and nobody stepped on it. So yeah, basically you can jump higher than normal, but you can't jump extremely high. And I just placed that and I have no idea where it went. Did you see where it went? I didn't see where it went. Okay. Where are we going to go? There's a random chicken. No, but like seriously, if you know, guys comment down below. Why is there a random chicken following me? Okay. Right, I think I'm gonna add some music and speed this up. Okay, that bit over. So, yeah. I don't really have much to say about this game other than it's pretty entertaining and can suck you into it. Oh wait, no, that sounds kind of weird. What I'm trying to say is it's very entertaining and it will get you playing for quite a while. Although I thought I was playing this for like 20 hours and then I ended up only playing it for eight minutes. So, um, so yeah, this game is pretty entertaining. I would recommend it. And I'm actually gonna go into another sped up version because I'm just standing here for that time. So yeah guys, that is going to be it for today and if you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like, smash the subscribe button and turn on all notifications so you never miss another video. Bye!